All right, we started off with two chicken breasts right in our air fryer. I chopped them up into smaller pieces. Now I'm gonna go right into my orange bell peppers that I sliced up into thin pieces. This is gonna be such an easy and delicious air fryer dinner. If you love Mexican inspired dishes, you're gonna love this. Next, we're coming in with our red bell pepper and we're doing one whole pepper for each color. You can do whatever colors you want. You could add some green in here. I'm gonna add some yellow right after this red and we're just putting it all on top of that chicken. Like I mentioned, we're doing some yellow. Let's just quickly get this in our air fryer so we can get dinner started. Oh my goodness, I don't know about you guys, but I love me some bell peppers, beautiful. Now we're going right into our onions, which we also cut into thin slices. You can do red, yellow, or white onions. Whatever your favorite onion is, just throw it in there. That is the best part of this recipe. It's fully customizable. Okay, those onions smell so sweet and delicious. I am happy. Now this is gonna kinda give it away, but we're gonna grab our Taco Bell Original Fajita Seasoning Mix. You can use whatever fajita mix you can find. This was just the only one I could find at Walmart, and plus it is amazing. And we're gonna use that whole packet of fajita mix because we are making chicken fajitas in the air fryer. Yep, you heard that right. This is the best way to make fajitas and the quickest way. Now to make sure we get some moisture, we are gonna gra grab our olive oil. You could do avocado oil if that's your preference. And we are gonna drizzle that right on top of all of those delicious veggies and that chicken. This will also help brown up the veggies in the chicken, which is exactly what we want. Go back in with our tongs and it's time to give this a good and healthy mix. Make sure all those pieces of chicken get fully seasoned. Make sure all those veggies get fully seasoned. Now, at this point, I would have added some lime juice and some limes, but I completely spaced at the store. So you guys, if you do make this recipe, make sure to grab some limes. Do not be a fool like me and forget the limes. Make sure to put it on your grocery list. But regardless, I think this is going to taste amazing because look how potent that seasoning is going to be. I think that looks pretty well coated. What do you think, babe? I think this looks absolutely delicious. Can't wait to see it cooked. Yeah. All right, it is time for the magic to happen. Go ahead and turn on our air fryer. We're gonna air fry this. We're gonna put the temp to 350. And then this is gonna cook for 18 minutes. Quickest cook chicken cooking ever. All right, the 18 minutes is up. I'm just gonna keep this on off and let that sit in there while we get our tortillas out. I have the flour tortilla fajitas. We're going to grab our plate and get these ready. I want to keep those nice and warm in there. Okay, I'm going to do three fajitas. How much we made is good enough for two people. Remember, I used two chicken breasts, so it should be about six fajitas total. We get our chicken out, which we're going to do right now. Oh my, look at those beautiful roasted veggies. All right, let's go ahead and grab our tortilla and our chicken, our onions, our bell peppers. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, look how beautiful those veggies roasted. You don't need a grill to get roasted veggies. All right, we have our fajitas here. Close this up, keep it warm. Now, we're gonna top this off with some sour cream. This is optional. Just a line on each fajita. And then lastly, while it's hot, I'm gonna throw on some Mexican cheese so it can maybe melt a little bit. But you can put, you know, some guacamole on there, some salsa, whatever you like. You can do some rice, some beans, just throw it in there. But this is how I like my fajitas. All right, you guys, it is time to try this deliciousness, that chicken. Oh my gosh. Sour cream kind of helps it hold it together. Mm. Is it good? Mm. 